falling for you. Hello, lovely viewers. This is your girl Evie. Welcome to Tasty and Fresh Kitchen where we prepare tasty meals with fresh ingredients. Yes, I want to use this opportunity to thank every one of you for how far we have come. It's the doing of the Lord and it is so, so marvelous in our eyes. If you are new to my channel, thank you for joining the winning team and welcome. Kindly click on the notification button so that anytime I post a new video, you will be notified. Share with you how I make my Entrawa album with MPC. Yes, so you know what? Let's get started. So these are my basic ingredients and of which I'll list all the ingredients in the description box so you check them out. So I have some garden eggs, scotch bonnet pepper, shallots, onion, kako, the secret, yes, or stockfish, and then momone, safru momone, yes, that's also known as salted fish, some tomatoes, turkey berries, I have some mackerel and some eggs, and my palm oil, zomi papebi yes this dish or delicacy is mostly enjoyed by we the akans in ghana yes it's very simple to prepare but yet nutritious and healthy yes so you know what let's get started so to begin with i soak my stockfish in water for like about 20 minutes yes it's salty and sometimes has some sun around it a bit sandy yeah so i soak it whilst i prep the other ingredients So I boil my garden eggs, tomatoes, peppers for like about 15 minutes. Yeah, you can use eggplant or aubergine. It's also cool. So you can see it's boiling here. So it's halfway cooked. So I'll add my tomatoes. And then my salted fish yeah i don't want it to melt away so i just put it in the wrapper and then tie it and then allow it to boil for just about two three minutes then i also add my kaku for it to also cook for like about five to six minutes so now i begin with my aboom yeah so this is my earthenware the cast iron type yes i really enjoy using it <laughs> so my apotoyua is the cast iron type and then there's my tapoli or pistol so i grind my onions just a me tree so what you see yeah and the table is a bit slippery so i'll just put some paper towel there and then yes it is helping So at this point, my veggies are cooked. So I add my peppers and turkey berries. That's the kwehususa or bedroom. And 
and sometimes for my bedroom not to scatter i also tie it in a rubber so that it will be very simple for me to get it in grind so how do we call this process is it grinding or tanning or <laughs> just a me tree please if you know the english name kindly leave your comments below <laughs> very necessary <laughs> yes trust me it's a bit of hard work <laughs> But I enjoy doing it. So I add my garden eggs bits by bits. You can choose to remove the seeds or not. So you grind so it's a bit smooth yes of late with the corporate ladies <laughs> we don't like doing this <laughs> so i add my fresh tomatoes sometimes we i choose to roast the tomatoes and it's also good but i love it's boiled So gone were the days, this is how our grandmothers were blending their veggies. There wasn't any blender, so you're going to do this so your veggies is as smooth as what we used for today. They really tried. <laughs> they deserve some accolades, you know. If you agree with me, just leave a comment below. So I add my salted fish, that's my momone. Yes, a boom without momone or bedu. That one is it a boom. I taste for salt then I add a little salt to it so as you can see as I'm grinding I'm dressing the bowl then I have my mackerel seasoned with some onion some salt some little spice which is optional and i also have my eggs on fire i have my palm oil 
and some onion for more flavor and taste and then my appam and yam to complement it with it so here we are our intro album or garden eggs stew with yam is ready so i just dress it with some oil palm oil and then serve my family they really enjoy this dish in fact when i prepared this dish so i urge you to also prepare this for the family and trust me they're going to enjoy it it's healthy it's natural and it is nutritious very simple to prepare so please try this and send me a comment below thank you so much for the growth so far i really appreciate you god bless you so see you in our next video i love you guys i love you i love you i love you bye bye